دوستان کشتار زندانیان سیاسی در زندانهای جمهوری اسلامی در سال 1988 29 ساله شد در تابستان 1988 هزاران هزار زندانی سیاسی توسط جلادان رژیم جمهوری اسلامی جان خود را از دست دادند امروز شما و ایرانیان بسیاری در سرتاسر سر دنیا دور هم جمع شدند تا خاطره جانباختگان تابستان 1988 در زندانهای جمهوری اسلامی را گرامی بدارند همانطور که میدانید در 5 جون 2013 پارلمان فدرال کانادا بنا به درخواست جمعی از ایرانیان لایحه ای را به تصویب رساند که طی آن کشتار زندانیان سیاسی در زندانهای جمهوری اسلامی در تابستان 1988 به عنوان جنایت علیه بشریت به رسمیت شناخته شد من امروز آرزو داشتم که در کنار شما باشم ولی به علت دوری از کانادا معذورم ولی کماکان خود را در کنار شما عزیزان و خانواده هایی که عزیزانشان را از دست دادند احساس می کنم کشتار زندانیان سیاسی در تابستان 1988 در زندان های جمهوری اسلامی هم برگ ننگی نیست در تاریخ جمهوری اسلامی ایران ایرانیان به هیچ وجه و هیچ وقت این زایه بزرگ را فراموش نخواهند کرد Speaker, there are many families of Iranian heritage in my great riding of Oak Ridges Markham and in the Richmond Hill riding of my colleague MPP Reza Moridi and many here with us today in the public gallery. I rise today to recognize a grim anniversary that our constituents will never forget. This summer marks the 25th anniversary of the largest massacre of political prisoners in Iran. In the summer of 1988, thousands of political prisoners were executed without trial. Most conservative estimates suggest nearly 5,000 Iranian political prisoners lost their lives during this period. Many independent legal assessments have concluded that the killings amount to crimes against humanity under international law. Those who carried out this massacre have never been brought to trial. The families of their victims here in Ontario and around the world await justice. Those who lost loved ones can never be truly whole. We want our constituents to know that we support them. Mr. Speaker, today, Canada's federal members of Parliament will consider a motion at the House of Commons to recognize the 1988 summer massacre as constituting a crime against humanity. I hope that the loss felt by our constituents and by Iranians around the country is recognized by the federal government and then from its official recognition, they find some small measure of comfort. Thank you, Mr. Speaker. The Minister of Research and Innovation on a point of order. Mr. Speaker, I have a point of order and uh, I believe that we have the unanimous consent to observe a moment of silence to commemorate the victims of the 1998 execution of Iranian political prisoners by the Islamic Republic of Iran. The uh, minister has asked for a moment of silence uh, designating uh, the massacre and uh, with the member's permission I'll finish the statement and then come back at the end of the statement for a moment silence. Uh, is that acceptable to the member? Thank you. Unanimous consent. Agreed. Agreed. Reports by committees. Last call for reports by committees. The Minister of Research and Innovation on a point of order. Mr. Speaker, uh, I would like to correct my record. I said uh, the year 1998. The actual year is 1988. The member has a right to correct his record, and that will now show. Pursuant to the uh, unanimous consent offered to have a moment silence uh, for the individuals that lost their lives to this disaster, I would ask all members of the House to stand uh, for a moment of silence.
I thank all members for their cooperation.